The Xzone Com can send measurement data and alarms to a cloud server. Cloud data can be accessed via the website www.oremcloud.de. To do this, you need to put a tick in the mCloud setting in the Xzone Com Manager software. The Xzone must then have sent at least one email to the cloud. The cloud can be tested for 30 days before a license is required. You first need to create an account on the website. Confirm the registration in the email sent by the cloud. You can then register the Xzone Com. The device ID and name can be found in the manager software. The Xzone Com is now registered and appears in the devices list. The sending status, battery status and license are also listed here. Clicking on the device ID displays a status page. Various information about the status of the Xzone Com is shown here. The option to monitor the sending interval is here, as well as license information. Clicking on Last Measurement Point takes you to the page displaying gas concentration diagrams for the Xzone Com. The time period to be displayed, as well as gas types or alarms, can be chosen. Gas alarms are shown as gold and red triangles. Device alarms as red squares. When live mode is selected, the website waits for data transmission from the Xzone Com. If data is received, the page automatically refreshes itself and shows possible changes or alarms. In the map menu, all registered Xzone Coms are shown on a map. The colored frames reflect the sending status of the Xzone Com. Devices whose sending intervals are within the monitoring time are colored green. Even from here, you can jump directly to the measured values. To do this, click on the Measured Values link. The Xzone Com data can only be viewed in the cloud if either a recognized email address and password are entered or if an Xzone Com has been registered with the hardware ID and a self-generated individual name. The license is linked to the Xzone Com, not the user.